we're going to draw a cartoon goat. Um, I have this picture here. Hopefully you all can see that. So, um, pretty simple, but we're going to work together on it. And what you'll need for supplies, um, you're going to need a pencil, an eraser, some colored pencils, um, markers or crayons will work too. All right, get your supplies together and we'll get started. Okay, if you have your pencil and your piece of paper, we can get started. Um, I'm going to use a Sharpie so you can see what I'm drawing. So if you'll just follow along, um, we're going to draw our goat picture. And just to show you again, this is um, the picture that we're going to try to draw. Cartoon goat. All right, first thing you need to do is you want to get near the middle of your paper and a little bit to the left. Um, we're going to draw the goat's nose. So we're going to do that by writing a letter V. Kind of curve it at the bottom a little bit like that and then we're going to draw um, close it off at the top and just with a little bit of a curved line right there all right so that's the nose all right on each side of the nose we're going to draw two circles we're going to try to keep them the same size and um, they're going to be kind of far apart so we're going to draw a circle here and a circle over here all right all right, then in the upper corner of the eye, we're going to draw a circle here and then another one over here. So we're going to just have that be the reflection right there. And then the bottom part of the eye, you can color that in um, with your pencil or marker later. I'm going to do it now. Okay. All right, so we got the two eyes. Then um, down here at the bottom, we're going to draw the head shape. So on the bottom side, we're going to do U-shape that's going to be a little bit shorter. And then on the top side, we're going to draw it so it's a little bit taller. So just watch me and then you can do it. Um, if you're watching this video and drawing along with me, um, you can pause the video and you can also um, rewind if you need to. All right, so we're going to start here. We're going to go down, kind of a U-shape, around, and then back up on this side. All right. And then on the top, we're going to go up a little bit higher. So we're going to go up, around, and connect it back down. Okay, so we just drew the head of our goat. All right, on top of their head, um, they have some horns. So we're going to draw two horns right above the eyes here. And you can decide how big you want those to go. And I just rounded them off at the top. All right, and then on the horns, we're going to draw some curved lines to make them look like they're round, so they look like horns. Almost like a unicorn horn, but um, they've got two. Okay, then we need to draw the ears. So we're going to start right here beside the horns, and we're going to draw a line that kind of curves down this way, and then one that curves down this way. Okay. And then we're going to curve back in. So it's going to be the ears of our goat. And they have kind of floppy ears. All right, if you want to, on your eyes, if you want to be a girl, you could do some little eyelashes or you could just draw some little um, eyebrows. Or you could do uh, both. You could do eyebrows and eyelashes if you want to be a girl. Um, also, we're going to draw a little mouth. So just draw a line right here. And then we're going to connect that with a straight line down here. Okay, so that's his mouth. All right. Does your goat need a beard? If you want to give your goat a beard, you can just draw a little V-shape right here for a beard. All right, and then we're going to draw the body. So we're going to start right here beside the beard. If you don't have a beard, just start a little bit off to the side of the mouth here. And we're going to draw a curved line down like this. Okay, and then we're going to go back over here on the side of his head, and we're going to draw a, his back and his back leg here. So we're going to go out, and then down, and we want to go down as far as we went on this one here. So go to the same distance right here. Okay, we're going to skip a space. We're going to go back up. It's going to be for the leg right here, and then you can just connect that together at the bottom. All right, we're going to make a little T line right here. 
And then we're going to start another leg right here. So we're going to go down. And I have a little bit of a curve to that. Around. Make it about the same width. And then back up. And go up above that line right there. Okay. And then we're going to go over here on this side. We're going to do the same thing. So we're going to curve around. Try to keep them about the same width. We're going to go up. Okay, a little bit shorter than this line right here, but stop right there. And then we're going to draw a curve for his belly right here. So just draw a curve line that goes up a little bit at the back. All right, so our goat is missing a leg. So we need to add one more leg right here. And we're going to make this one a little bit shorter because it's on the back side. So we're going to go down, curve, and then back up. Okay, so our goat needs some hooves. So we're going to draw a line here at the bottom on each leg. All right, and then we're going to draw a line in the middle of each hoof. Okay, and one more detail. <clears throat> Our goat needs a tail, so you're going to draw a tail right here. So just draw a curve line up and then go back down like that. Okay. <clears throat> All right, and that is our goat. Um, <clears throat> so what you want to do now is you can add any details if you want to add some grass or like a line here so he's standing on grass. You can do that. If you want to do some grass, you can draw some grass. Draw it down here too. You can draw the sunshine. Nice sunny day. That's a really tiny sun, isn't it? It's far away. Do some clouds. I don't know. What other details can you add to your picture? I'm not going to show you. I want you to add your own details. So you can draw whatever you want to. All right. When you're all done, I'd like you to color it in. And you can see here I used yellow and orange. But you can use any colors you want. Goats are different colors. And since this is a cartoon, you could do a blue goat if you wanted to. Um, and you can see here I left a little bit of white around his mouth right here, like his snout. So it looks like it sticks out a little bit. Um, so you decide how you want to color in your goat. Um, when you're all done, share it on Seesaw so I can see it. All right, have a good day. Bye. Mm -hmm.